the government in Germany decided actually to build to build in a country with no resources, like Germany is, uh, to build up uh, a, a strong research uh, uh, environment. And that's why they decided uh, 60 years ago to build up uh, some kind of three pillars of uh, of research. One is a fundamental research, and, th and this is and they created the Max Planck. Max Planck Society. Then uh, they decided to put a lot of uh, effort in an applied research, something like uh, research who provides uh, German industry with uh, new inputs, and that they created Fraunhofer Society. And then the third one, which is are, are the universities. Also, a, pr a director in one at Max Planck at or, or Fraunhofer is at the same time also professor at a university. So they are trying more or less actually, you know, to, to head ad personam kind of bridges in between these three pillars of research. Now, um, uh, innovation actually is attached to, to, to Fraunhofer because that's, that's uh, the mission of, uh, of, of that actually. Innovation means actually that the results of, of, of what we are doing are going in products and you make money out of it uh, or it's put, put on, it's not, uh, it's not only, in, it's not invention, it's innovation, which is a big, big difference uh, I'm, uh, in between the two, two, two aspects. The, the system changes also the KPI, the uh, key parameters, indicators for, for institutions like, like Fraunhofer. You are, for example, uh, very much, uh, uh, you know, appreciated based on licenses, based on patents, based on, uh, um, on, on, um, on uh, spin-off uh, company you are created, less on, on journal publication, which is normal, normally the quality required in a, in, a, in, a, in a university and things like so that. So for you the incentive is not only to, to discover something, but to put it in, in practice. the practice, yeah, mm -hmm. to put it in products. Huh? You want to transfer it in the, in, in the industry. And we have two, two ways to transfer, either, either in, the, the industri in the industrial uh, partner who paid for the project which we started, or by, by doing a uh, uh, spin-off where the whole team is get, gets out of the institute and, and create, create a, create a spin-off and... Uh, like a new startup company? Exactly. Okay. Okay. Yeah. And we have uh, quite a lot of uh, startup companies. <coughs> uh, and we have also exits. We sold these companies, which brought, a couple of them brought us quite a lot of money, uh, which we put again in, in the research. We have actually to, to earn on the market from the industry 60% from our, from our budget. And if you don't succeed that, your institute, you know, is decreasing and becoming smaller and smaller and smaller and moment in time doesn't exist anymore. And in general, if you look at uh, the European programs, for example, you know, the, the, the framework program of what you have, they all, always actually finance, finance only 50% of what, what, we, what, uh, what you need. So it's recommended in general actually to, to, to go with an uh, with industrial partner, which finance the rest on it. So the idea is to push, to push by, 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 by uh, money of the government, this type of relationship in, in between. It's, that's what they are trying actually <laughs> Uh, to, to, to do with, uh, with their money, actually to, to, to build, you know, this relationship in between, between uh, uh, research institutions and, uh, or, or uh, universities and uh, in industry. Even now the government in Germany, they have programs, programs on different, on security, on whatever kind of programs. And they, they are requesting, actually they put some money into it are requesting for, for proposals. So the industry is coming in general with, with a, in, and they are requesting to, to have, um, to have a, a industrial partner and, uh, and uh, ac somebody from the academia or university or the research institute to formulate the, the, the proposal. And uh, then uh, 
if uh, you are successful in uh, formulating such a proposal and the government you know chooses you in in a combination with industrial partner then you are working with this industrial partner for two years but in two years you know them very well and this is the way actually where you interact very 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 close and uh, what happens at the end is uh, for example with Hitachi we, we prolonged our our contract I think four times so we are in the 20 years already already with them so they are they are calculating with us they they, they plan us in their R&D planning so so it's not anymore you know kind of uh, you know it's a lot of trust we know the people you can speak with them you can can do a lot of a lot of funny things uh, because it's not very easy to 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 work with Japanese uh, but we know how to work with them so it's a lot of a lot of uh, um, things which are already regulated, you know.